My stitch fix arrived today so, and it's a gloomy day, it's raining, sun hasn't been out and I'm like, let's just get the camera out, open up stitch fix, do a try on and just go from there. Hi everyone, I'm Barbara, welcome to my channel and welcome to a stitch fix unboxing and a try on. Get that noise out of the way. Uh, let's see. I, don't, I think everybody knows what Stitch Fix is about. What is going on with my hair? I did not plan the film today, but we'll just go with it. Uh, Stitch Fix has a $20 styling fee. Anything that you purchase is applied to uh, your purchase. And the $20 styling fee. Shipping is free both ways. And you get five items. They do send you a preview. You can pick up to five items. If you pick nothing or you just pick a few items or one, the stylist will um, fill those with other items. They send you a prepaid pre envelope to send everything back. Uh, let's see. This is, what is this? Oh, stitch fix number 74. Wow. Uh, let's see. So it has the items on here, the pricing, uh, any credits that you might have, and the discount if you keep all five items. So we'll take a look at that. I'll give you the pricing as we as I show you each item when I try it on. And my stylist, Melissa, she's been with me so long. Melissa, if you are watching this, you have really stuck with me and I appreciate you. Uh, so there is a, a note from my stylist in a way that, to stylist things that are in the box. So this is a small box. Look at how little that is. Here is my bundle. So we'll take a look, see what's in here. Hopefully, I didn't ask for anything particular. Um, I had been sick. I have had strep throat for the second time in two months, which this time really knocked me out. Um, I had a hard time getting back into the swing of things, and I developed a cough from it, which I didn't have a cough the first time I had it. So it's no fun. It is not fun. Um, also, if you stay till the end, I'll give you a little update on what's going on with our dining room and the decorating of that. Nothing else has been done. There is a centerpiece that I bought, but um, I'll give you a little update. And then when the dining room is decorated through a virtual decorating service, then I will share all that with you. But we are making progress. So, okay, let's get started. Oh, this is cute. Here is a skirt. This is the only item that I said yes to in my preview, although, <laughs> Not sure if it's gonna fit. It is by Tribal, I think. I like Tribal. Yeah, uh, we'll see. It's got some stretch in it. It's this nice, pretty red top. And it looks like, uh, looks like it's three quarter sleeves, V-neck. Looks cute. I'm not sure about the material. It's just really feels thin, but it feels soft. Oh, this is cute. What is this? Look at the sleeves on this. How cute is that? Is it elastic? Yep, this is black. That's cute. Okay, I like that. Uh, this is blue, like a navy blue. This is cute sweater. It's got some kind of ribbing. Hmm. Nice transition pieces. And, oh, a jacket. Oh, look how cute this is. Oh, it looks small. Ooh. I don't know if this is going to fit, but it sure is cute. Look at this. It looks like it's navy. It's got the zippers, pockets. Looks like snaps. Yep, snaps. Look at the back. It has like a, it's got stitching. Cute, this is really cute. Eden Society, hmm, never heard of them. Okay, let's get to try on.
Okay, I like this outfit. The sweater is a, it's kind of like a medium, um, a medium weight. It's a wide knit, wide rib, I guess, sweater. Um, it is Evolution by Cyrus. It is, I'm wearing a size small. It is $68. Yeah, seems pricey. $68 for this. But I like the length of it. I like that it's not real tight around my midsection. It feels soft. It is hand wash, but I really like it. But can I get something like similar for less money? Yes. I mean, $68 is a lot for just this and it's hand washed, but I have it. I like it. It fits. So we'll just have to see how the rest of the box works out. All right. Let's talk about this skirt. Love this skirt, but I'm not sure if it's right for me. I would not tuck a shirt in because I've got some belly rolls going on here. I do not have span, um, Spanx on. I, um, it is not real tight fitting. I am wearing a size 10, and it kind of rolls up, but that's the belly pulling it up. But with that said, I really like the way it feels. I like the length. It's easy to wear. I'm wearing a size 10. They say this is navy. It's by Tribal. It's the Tyra, Ty, uh, Tyla pencil skirt for $54. It's got seams here. And it's got some kind of seams up here, but there's no pockets. It is high-waisted on me. So when I walk, it does ride up, but you know what? With the belly, anything's gonna do that unless I buy a dress. So I don't know, I like this. Oh, I tried on a denim jacket with it just to see if I could like dress it down a little bit because my lifestyle is very, very casual. So I have this cut from the cloth jacket. I have no idea how old this thing is but I like it sprayed on the bottom. So I like the way it pulls it all together. I don't know. Looks good with this jacket. I tried the jacket on with this that came in the box, but it's too much navy on navy. And I think this sets it apart a little bit. I could wear sandals, maybe put on a pair of gym shoes if I really wanna be casual. I don't know, you guys. I like the skirt. It's gonna be a maintenance thing. And maybe if I get some, put on some shapewear, that that will help hold that in. And I have nothing really nice to wear. Nothing fits, so I have to refill my closet. I was waiting to see if I could get in shape a little bit. I'm tired of waiting. I'm just gonna, you know, I gotta buy some clothes. So I don't know, what do you guys think? All right, let's try something else on. I put my jeans on so I could show you the red top and the jacket. I love this jacket. I am wearing a size small. It is by Eden Society. It is a collared cargo jacket. I'm wearing a size small. It's $88, a ton of stretch. Has the snaps here, which I would probably never close, but I'm excited it fits. It has pockets underneath these flaps. So flaps cover the pockets. It has the zippers on each side. The collar, the neck. Uh, the sleeves are a good length. I'm 5'4", have average, no, actually I'm 5'3". I have average, I don't think my arms are long and I don't think they're short. Um, this is really, really cute. I love this jacket. Back, there's the stitching. So it gives you that fitted look, which I like. It's a little short, but I'm okay with that. I like to have it a little bit longer, but I really like this jacket. The stretch is unbelievable, like a ton of stretch in this thing. And I would wear short sleeves underneath it. 
Okay, so I'm gonna keep the jacket unless I watch the video back and I'm like, uh, no, but pretty sure I'm gonna keep it. It is not lined, which I'm usually not a fan of unlined jackets. They tell you how much this is? $88, $88 for this. I like it, I like it a lot. Of course, I'm going to check pricing on everything. All right, let's talk about this top. Um, okay, I don't like the way it fits. Look at the arms. <laughs> they look like they're like saggy arms. There's just no shape to it. V-neck, this is by Bobo, I think it's how you say it. Uh, very thin material, it feels too big. And I think it's the floppy sleeves. Um, I don't think it does much for my shape. I'm kind of sucking it in. The length is good. The price on this is $54. This is a size small, but it just feels so big. So it is called the Ravina three quarter puff sleeve red top. So this is a no. So one more top, I'll be right back. Last top, this is so cute. I love the fit of this top. I like the feel of it. The length is good. I like the sleeves are the sheer sleeves. It is a little tight around my arm. It's elastic, but it's not too bad. This top is only $40, size small. I only say, I say only 40. I mean, compared to the navy top, which was, I think, $68. I like the V-neck of it. It feels light. It feels airy. Um, I don't know. I really like it. I like it a lot. So, I don't know. This is probably going to be a keeper. What do you guys think of the items? Let's go over them real quick. The jacket I want to keep. I'm gonna watch the video back. Love the jacket. I love this. The red top is a definite no. And I really like these two together with my jacket. Um, let's see, how much is this? The entire box, if I keep everything, is $304. Buy all, you save $76. So the red top is 54. It would make sense to keep the entire box and donate the red blouse. Um, let's see, so my subtotal would be $228 and I have a $25 credit, which would bring my box down to $203 for all five items. I don't know, you know, I can buy a navy top like this at Target for like 20 bucks. Um, not sure about the skirt because it rides up, but I like the way I feel in it. I'll have to hear what you guys say and um, go from there. Look at the video. Okay, so if you lasted this long, you might be interested in knowing what's going on with the dining room. Let me give you a spin around and show you just kind of a reminder of where we're at. All the paperwork is off, finally off of the table. So this is what we have to work with. The lighting's not good. Let's see, so here's blank wall. We're trying to decide what we wanna do with that wall. We've decided we're gonna do black blinds on the windows and then put curtains in between each window. Those do not open. Uh, we need to get a rug for underneath the table, some accessories, and then the large door patio door, we are going to do blinds on that also. So this is the space we're trying to decorate first with Havenly. My designer has been excellent. Um, I have a few different options uh, where I've made some changes. I will pop up a couple of the options that she originally designed for us. And then we're getting real close to making the decision and then um, I will give you a reveal once it's all done, which is gonna take probably a couple months because it's gonna take that long just to get the blinds in. And we're trying to decide, let me know what you guys think. The decorative wall, 
Um, I've seen some designers that just leave it blank and maybe just put a mirror standing up on it or just leave it blank because once you get a rug in here, it's going to fill that space a little bit more, put a plant in the corner, get the blinds, get the drapes up. So we're debating if we're going to do a sideboard buffet table or nothing because the one that we picked out from the designer is glass. So you can see the shelves. That means dusting. That means just knickknacks, decorative things in there because you're not going to put anything in there that I'm going to use. I, I just don't have anything that I would put in there. So it would have to be all decorative items. So let me know your thoughts. Thanks for watching everyone. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.